Good morning, loves. I am absolutely tired this morning. I just feel like I thought I was getting over my sickness that I had, which wasn't really a sickness. I just kind of felt like really weak. But today I feel super tired. My head hurts. I feel weak. And last night I even felt a little nauseous, um, which, I mean, I guess I should probably take a pregnancy test because I haven't taken one in a couple of months and since I don't get my time of the month, I mean, at least I haven't gotten it since I have been like breastfeeding. Like I have not had a, a time of the month since giving birth. And I already took a pregnancy test at like two months postpartum and it was negative. So I guess I should probably take another one, but it was so weird. I felt like I had a massive headache last night and I was cramping and I woke up because of it and I just took some Tylenol and went back to bed and it was fine but I just I feel like I got no sleep and my stomach is just a little queasy so I don't know anyway I am uploading the vlog for today Hunter is sitting in his swing over there we're watching um, Hotel Transylvania 3 I believe it is but I'm probably gonna go down for a nap when he goes down for his first nap and possibly even for his second nap. And then I'll probably just have John like take him or go somewhere with him or just hang out with him later when he gets home so that I can edit the vlog for tomorrow. So we got the pool blowed up. We just got it in the mail literally like a couple minutes ago. Mr. Man's sitting in it and he was laughing. Huh, mama being silly. like your new pool? We're gonna put a bunch of balls in it so that you can play? Yeah. You gotta go take a nap though, Mr. Man. Yeah. Unfortunately, the balls probably won't be here for a while. It said, well, it, they're coming from China. So, it said between like February 15th and March 15th or March 11th or something like that. So it's a pretty big range where it's when it's supposed to get here and of course the tracking number doesn't work because it's a Chinese tracking number So Google won't pull it up for me, but hopefully the balls will be here soon and we can fill this thing up with balls We only got 500. I think we're gonna need a lot more than 500 But we started off with 500 to just see how it'll look Meanwhile the pugs over there in the corner <laughs> She's like, you took my bed away. Now there's a stupid pool. <laughs> Lily, come on. Let's go, Pug. Let's go. Come on, Lily. Let's go. <laughs> Silly Pug. So we'll see, but he has been eating like the plain vegetables uh, without the baby cereal. At least the past two nights he's eaten it. Like last night and the night before he ate it. Um, 
Like I put some in his baby cereal and then after that I fed him just the straight baby food. And um, he seemed to eat it, but I don't know. Sometimes he can be picky, huh? You're a picky boy. This one is corn and sweet potato. Uh, it smells like straight up corn, like really strong. Is it good? Do you like it? He always closes his mouth sometimes. I was not prepared for this, but his poop is like super solid now. Like, which I was not aware that that was gonna happen like when he's like just starting out with baby food, but yeah. Since I've introduced this stuff, it's been a lot more um, solid, which is a little TMI, but sorry. Look at him, he's opening his mouth. He's like, mom, give me it. Mom, don't talk about my poop when I'm eating. Like I, so I got this one, I think I got squash, and then I got green beans and peas, and then I got the sweet carrots again, because he liked the sweet carrots. I'm only gonna open up one, <gasps> one can at a time, or one little jar at a time, because, I mean, I just opened this today. He's probably about, he's about right here on the, on the jar, which is good, because I just, well, I opened it last night, and they're only good for two days after you open them. So, I'm only going to keep one open, especially since it's only four ounces. And I think the paperwork, I have to look at it again, but I think it said four to five ounces of vegetables. Or it could have been two to three ounces of vegetables per day. He kind of usually eats maybe like half um so about two ounces a day so i don't want to open more and then them go bad you know i actually didn't end up taking a nap during his second nap usually he takes a longer nap than just an hour at least the past couple days he's been doing that where he'll take like a two hour nap or an hour and a half nap or an hour and 45 minute nap for at least one of his naps but today his first nap was an hour his second nap was an hour so um He's just like, I want to take normal naps today, Mom. I don't need a long nap. Huh. Out of all the fussiness and stuff, I do have to say, I feel like Hunter has been pretty good with, like, sleep. Because I have people message me all the time on Instagram, like, oh, my baby's not sleeping, I don't know what to do. And I'm like, honestly, I mean, I can give you advice and tell you, like, maybe you should look up sleep training and stuff like that. But to be honest, Hunter has always been pretty good at sleeping. He went through a couple rough patches where he wasn't taking long enough naps or, and he did go through his four month sleep regression where he was sleeping like three to four hours at a time at night. But he got past that and he got past the whole nap situation thing and he's a really good sleeper. And mm. I know some of you message me as well and say, oh, well, how did you get your little one accustomed to the crib, you know? Because they are they say that, you know, their baby is sleeping in a rock and play and now they can't keep their baby in a rock and play to sleep because they're rolling over now. It's kind of hard for me to give some advice because he was actually pretty good with um, going into his crib. I mean, I swaddled him when he went into his crib, but I also swaddled him before he went into his crib because he slept in like, um, not a rock and plate, it was a pack and plate, like the bassinet part. So he, it was kind of similar to his crib, you know, it was a flat surface, it was a big open flat surface, it wasn't like a bassinet, like a normal bassinet that you put in your room. 
And also we transitioned him into the crib, into his own room at two months old. And I think that really helped us transitioning him really early because he was still sleeping a lot. So he, he slept really well in his crib and he learned that, you know, that's his sleep space. That's why he takes such good naps in his crib and he actually takes better naps in his crib than if we were like on the go or if we were like at someone else's house. So I try to like plan around his nap times now, but I seriously wish I could give like better advice because that's what I'm here for. But I just kind of feel like I've been blessed with a son that has been pretty decent with sleep. Do you want more? <laughs> Do you want more? Mama King, you up? You went eating more. Hopefully you don't spit it out because I took your bib off. No more? You're still eating it. Oh my goodness, child. Well, you stopped opening your mouth, so I assumed you were done. I think now that he's like accustomed to eating the baby food, I'm probably, when I'm done with these uh, jars, I'm probably just gonna make my own baby food because it'll probably be cheaper. So if any of you moms out there make your own baby food, send me any links or like advice and tips you have for me because I'm like, I don't know what I should do. Should I like steam the vegetables that I'm gonna make and then like um, puree them in with water and then put them in like ice cube trays and freeze them? And then like, how do you defrost them? Or should I just puree it and put it in jars and then go from there. I'm not sure how long they last in the fridge. Maybe I'll keep these jars. I probably should have kept those other two I had. I'll keep the jars and then, um, I have a feeling you are just gonna be an eater, huh? Like mama and papa, you going to snack with us? Man, I cannot wait. I know people say like, oh, just wait till they start eating solids and stuff. They're gonna wanna steal your food. But honestly, I can't wait for that. <laughs> I, and it's such a huge snacker. Us Ruperts are huge snackers. And <laughs> I can't wait for that, huh? We can just snack, watch movies, and play with toys, go on like picnics and stuff. Huh? Yeah. We'll have barbecues all the time because it's super hot here. We'll play with your new pool. God, he is still eating this stuff. Sorry, I feel like I've been rambling on a lot <laughs> right here, but I don't know. Do you guys like the long mm -hmm. vlogs? Do you like longer vlogs, like 15 minutes or so, like 15 to 20 minutes? Mm -hmm. Or would you prefer shorter vlogs that are like anywhere from like mm -hmm. six to eight minutes? Mm -hmm. So we're, oh, ow, ooh, Hunter, let go of my bun, <laughs> child. Hey, let go. Ow, 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 ah. Oh my goodness, child. We're laying in the pool, in the living room, and the pug is like, what the heck? Let me in there, why won't you let me in there? Pug, come on, let's go, come on. Get in there, come on. Oh! <laughs> pug, come here. Come on, come here. Lily, come here. Pug, where did she go? Pug, come here. <laughs> come here. Let's go. Come on, get in here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, Pug. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Come here. Let's go, Lily. Come here. <laughs> what are you doing back there? <laughs> Pug. Excuse you. Let's go. Come on, get in here, come on, come on. Yeah, Pug, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, now we're chilling in here with the Pug. Huh. Nice, huh? It's comfy. What are you doing grabbing your feet, you little nugget? <laughs> <laughs>